welcome back so today we'll go on to create database in mysql so here i have started my server which is a vamp server and to create mysql database on vamp server so just need to uh, click on this option called php my admin so this will take you to the next window which is uh, php my admin and here there are two ways to create a database one is from this database tab and other one from sql tab so let me click on sql tab then uh, just write the sql syntax here to create a simple database a statement called you know, create you know create database database then name of the database say example like uh, my db so my database then uh, click on go button so that database created and you can just see here that it listed so here you can see that my database or my db and right now it is empty that means no tables are uh, in this uh, you know database as of now so to create new table in this database or newly created database so again just go to sql tab now create a table so the syntax called create table okay. uh, say a table name called you know, employee employee and inside the bracket we need to mention number of columns say the first one called select e code that is employee code then the data type called var char or var char you know it is called string type and inside bracket we just mentioned the size or length of that particular you know column that means up to four character can be entered the next one here employee name uh, this also uh, var char which is of uh, string type so mention around 50 characters and then you know salary which is uh, you know integer type just mention integer so without any length that's all so three columns and table name called employee the first column would be like e code second column like e name and third one that is sal or salary so just click on go so the table created as you can see here there is a green check mark so that indicates the table or query has been executed successfully so here is my first table which is employee and in this one to insert record so just click on this table first then again go to sql tab right and now write you know dml operation you know query that's called insert operations or insert query so here insert into my table so first you need to write table name here that is employee table then mention first column as a employee code the second one called an employee name which is e name and third one as a uh, salary then uh, values so values so wherever var cars are there you need to mention within the single quotation mark so employee code one okay so then employee employee name and then some salary value so example uh, 18000 so the integer column should be outside the quotation mark now simply hit the go button here and then the record will be inserted you can see here one row inserted so just click on table here and you can see the record is inserted here employee code 1 ganesh and 18000 as a salary